Hi, a very short uh, video about square numbers. Square numbers are the numbers you get when you multiply a number by itself. That's a fairly straightforward concept. Let's do a couple of examples. Uh, what do you get when you multiply 2 by itself? 2 by itself means 2 times 2, doesn't it? And 2 times 2 is 4. And because 4 is a number we get when we multiply another number by itself, we say that 4 is a square number. It's as simple as that. Um, here's another one. What's 3 squared? Well, 3 squared means 3 times by itself. So 3 times 3. And 3 times 3 is 9. So again, we say that because 9 is a number we get when we times something by itself, 9 is a square number. Uh, that's it, really. Um, there's a couple of things to do. Um, one thing to tell you and, and a little challenge to give you. Um, it's the first thing to say is that um, when we talk about square numbers, there's a little symbol that you might have noticed or might have come across before, and it's as well that you know what it means. When we talk about 2 squared, we sometimes write 2 squared like this. We write 2 with a little 2 above it and to the right like that. It's called an index number. And that little 2 there that I've circled and pulled an arrow, it's called an index number, and it means squared, times by itself. Um, so 2 squared can be written like that. 3 squared is the same. 3, when you put that little 2 above and to the right like that, it means 3 times by itself, 3 times 3. So we'd write 4 squared like that. And 4 squared means, of course, 4 times by itself. And 4 fours are 16. Um, so that's uh, what square numbers are. This over here is how we write squared with the little index number, the little 2 like that. Um, and that's what it means. And a little challenge to finish off is, I wonder if you can work out all the square numbers up to 10 squared. So 1 squared, 2 squared, I've given you 2 squared and 3 squared and 4 squared here. Can you work out 5 squared and 6 squared and 7 squared and 8 squared and 9 squared and 10 squared? And maybe learn them all. Um, because it's, if you learn all your square numbers, um, you'll find it can help you sometimes with your times tables as well. If you know, for example, what 8 squared is, uh, then you can work out, um, you know what 9, then that means you know what 8 eighths are. And if you know what 8 eighths are, uh, but you're not sure about 7 eighths, you can work it out, can't you? Like if you know what 7 sevens are, if you know what 7 squared is, you can work out what 6 sevens are or what 8 sevens are by just adding or taking away from 7 squared. There we go, square numbers. How to write them, what they mean, and a little challenge for you. Learn a few uh, and get used to working with them.